what's up what's up it's your girl ty back with another video how y'all doing my trulies um before i get started into this video please like comment and subscribe and i know that's right see please like comment and subscribe hit the notification bell turn it gray so you'll be notified when i drop another video okay so i'm driving of course y'all can tell um this wasn't even the topic of this video but i just passed by a dude in a lift wheelchair outside washing his car a lift wheelchair washing his car and you know people have ex excuses and excuses and excuses of doing what now and this man is in a lift wheelchair washing his car by himself but that's not what i was calling to i mean that call it that's not what i was doing this video for of course you know i have to come to y'all with another video with, with video updates um i'm not consistent um we know that but you know so much has been going on i think the last video i posted was um uh, i think i was in the car in the garage at the hospital to see my grandma but unfortunately she's our guardian angel now she passed on the 17th um that was hard it was hard for us um it was hard i mean we knew you know she wasn't suffering anymore um because I'm, I'm not mistaken i'm not sure if i posted it in my previous video but she had cancer lung cancer about 10 years ago um she's been in remission over 10 years and it came back and when it came back it was stage four um so yeah she's not suffering no more but that was our baby that was my granny i'm blessed to still have one granny left that's my mom's mom um yeah so y'all it's family i'm gonna need y'all to take heed show them love while they're here because in a blink of an eye they could be gone like and every day I sit and I think I'm like, oh my god, my grandma's gone. Like it's like it's it's like I'm still in shock. Like we done buried her. There. Uh oh yeah, my phone about to fall. We've buried her and everything, but it still it it still seems so surreal. Um, yeah. And I I had just recently, like I said in the video, I had just recently moved back home. Um, because she was doing bad or whatever and I did not want nothing to happen and me not be here but I had moved back home on the 11th and she died on the 17th so I had six days with my grandma before she passed um let's see what's happened besides that on a brighter note your girl started working at this job um housekeeping I'm not gonna say what hotel but I've been doing housekeeping I've been working there three weeks now yeah i've been working up for three weeks and your girl got promoted in two weeks um your girl has been promoted there i mean has been promoted i was sorry i was reading the message your girl has been promoted um since working there two weeks ahead housekeeper executive housekeeper at that so that's exciting um i've never been in like a supervision type of role at a job i always been you know the worker um so this is exciting it's something new um no i'm not going to be one of those bitch supervisors um because the hotel i work at we're like family so i just want us to all pull together and make this hotel one of the best hotels in georgia um because you know i clean like i have like ocd so i'm real particular about the way i clean i'm real particular about the way i make my beds um because to me in hotel housekeeping when you oh when you rent when you rent in a hotel room the first thing you see is the bed that's the very first thing you see is the bed the bed is the center attraction of the room so it's like if that don't look if the bed looks jacked up that's not a very good presentation for the room 
So, yeah. So, I'm training my girls with my ladies, excuse me, my ladies to, you know, put, put, put forth more effort into their um, beds. You know, every job has a weed here and there. But we're going to get it together. But I'm excited about that. I haven't really been doing my business. I haven't really been making any candles or anything. But I do want to make a, um, I do want to make like a gift basket or a little smaller gift bag for all of my housekeepers to show them appreciation that I appreciate their hard work. You know, give them something to look forward to. I want to start doing like little, little prizes, like what, whichever housekeeper collects the most room keys by the end of the month, get a prize or something like that, or I buy them lunch or something like that. You know, give them incentives or something. Cause I know, you know, with me working and like I said, this is my first time ever being in a supervision, supervisory position. If you give them something to work forward to, they gonna push forward to it. You know what I mean? Don't just let them coming in. I don't want my I don't want my workers to come in dreading to come to work. Cause I for one finally, and it's sad to say, I for one finally enjoy getting up going to work. I, when I like today was my off day. I worked six days a week. Today was my off day. I miss going to work. I really want to go to work, but I know I had other stuff I needed to do today. So I enjoy going to work, and I want all of my workers, all of my housekeepers to do to feel the same. Like, oh, like, yeah, like, you know, don't look at it as a job. Like, make it enjoyable. You know what I mean? So that's my goal for my job or whatever. And I really am looking to grow with this company. Like, I made executive housekeeper in two weeks. Like, who to say in two months I won't be assistant GM? Cause I'm not stopping. Who's to say in six months I will be a general manager of a house of a hotel? So this is my niche. I thought nursing, I thought CNA was my niche. I've been doing CNA work for like ooh, 20 plus years. I love it. I enjoy it. But with COVID and everything out here, I'm not trying to go in that field. So I went and did what the second best thing that I like doing, which is cleaning. And that's my niche right now. And I'm enjoying it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I just wish I could, wish I could get more hours. Like, with me being executive. So, it's going to be... I could get up to 40, 45 hours. So, I'm going to start having to get my little tail up earlier. And get to work. And, you know, so I get my money. Because your girl trying to make boss moves. You know, it's, it's time. It's time to level up, honey yes but other than that i've been doing well love life is is it's the same um i'm single enjoying the single life i'm just mingling you know just mingling nothing serious um i guess this time it's just for me um you know i got a little sneaker link here and there but you know it's nothing major um well right now it's nothing major we just we just doing us pretty much um, just having fun. That's what it's all about, you know. Um, but other than that, yeah, your girl is just living life. And that's a big old tractor, y'all. It's been raining. The weather here is crazy. I don't know if I can switch the camera around, but I'm not going to even try to do that. But I'm headed to get my... I got myself a Christmas gift. Um, I very rarely buy myself stuff here lately. But, you know, today I just feel like, you know... Give me a little gift for myself, you know, because I, you know, I got to save for my place, you know. So every check, I'm trying to at least save a couple of hundred out of it, every, uh, every, all of my checks, so I can, you know, save up to get me a spot next year. I'm currently residing with my sister, so, you know, thank God for her. These people are driving crazy, y'all. I enjoy talking to y'all and riding. This is cool. This might be my, um, I can't call it Car Chronicles because I will be still somebody else's name, but we can call it, we have to come up with a name for it, truly. Like, what we gonna name it? With me talking to you all, vlogging in the car from my phone because I haven't got me a camera yet. Because I need to start taking this YouTube thing seriously. Because we are trying to get monetized so I can start making me some money. Yeah. 
Oh, I can't show y'all my hair, but my lock journey is coming along pretty, pretty good. Uh, girl, I got hang time. I can swing them now. I want to dye my tips. I want to bleach them. And let it be that. Or do them like a pink color or whatever. But. Oh, and when I redo my business, rebrand my business, because y'all know I'm always rebranding until I get happy with it. I have, I, I got a name that I'm, um. Um, cool with now it's gonna be called truly amazing creations that is my initials THC so and thanks to the person that gave me that helped me with that name um but yeah I think that's what I'm going that's what that's that's what the name is gonna be but um whenever I get myself situated to get everything squared away I'm gonna have to go back and get my business license and all that good stuff because I still I, I still enjoy creating. I love making my candles. I love doing my hand sanitizer, lotion, my body shimmers, my lip gloss, my body butters. Um, it's a lot of other stuff I want to create as well. With me being a Pisces, that's just who I am. And this truck is in the way. Oh my God. But yeah, they need to move. I got things to do and people to see. But I didn't want much of nothing. I was just coming to give you all an update while I was cruising to go pick up this order. Um, a shout out to all of my family, all of my friends that has been there for me, that has helped me through, you know, this crazy thing called life. I pray to God that I'm finally on my path right now um, with the finally getting a job, stable job that I actually like where I see growth and uh, potential in. Um, then I could go ahead and save, get me a house. Thanks to my son, I have a car to get back and forth to work. You know, I, you know, me, I'm, I'm, you know, my, okay. My dream car is a Mercedes. I'm not gonna lie. I don't care if it's an old or new Mercedes. I am in love with Mercedes Benz. If it's not a Mercedes, I would love a 2021, 20, 22 Nissan. Um, no, excuse me. 20, 2021, 20, 2022 Honda Accord Sport Navy Blue. Um, but, you know, until I get those, I am so forever grateful. <laughs> I am so forever grateful for everything that I have. Because I could not have a way to work. But my thank for my son when I got him another car. So I got his old car. And I'm driving it to work. Like, you know, hey, I keep it up. I keep the oil changed. I got my little car seat covers and stuff on. You know, thanks to my mom, my little steering wheel cover and stuff that match. I just got to clean it out. You know, because, again, your girl be here and there. You know, when that sneaker leak call, I have to go and chill or whatnot and just let me look at, and for those for the record for those you know i don't know the young folks call it a little sneaker leaks you know that's what we you know we took that from them but it's just a little you know a little cut of butter whatever a little friend i want to call them once you come through and sit down and chill it never it ain't necessarily always got to be sexual because everybody think just because you go chill with somebody it's sexual no it could just be time conversation um and that could just be it you know people always got to go to somebody draws and just think it's always sexual oh my god it ain't always sexual people always just think somebody around here just throwing coochie everywhere it ain't even that serious i'm about to get too old to be throwing coochie nowadays but i must stop oh, y'all see my hair now it's just everywhere honey i, I ain't just i'm just I, it done got wet it done got wet and everything so you yeah. know but yeah that's all i really ain't really been doing much of nothing besides working 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 and working but until my next video, y'all stay blessed. I love y'all. If anybody told you, I love you. God loves you the most. So until next time, 